Hello, welcome to one of my videos. Um, this is like my 11th video, I guess. Yeah, so thanks for that. Um, well, I'm gonna be doing like a three mini painting series. And right now I'm just cutting the paper because I... I, 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 d I didn't want it to use a canvas, alright? I'm sorry, I didn't want it to. But yeah, I just started here cutting the paper. Um... And then I'm going to, well, I I think I already mentioned that it's going to be three paintings. Then I regretted not doing the four, the four little papers. But it's too late now. I'm just editing now. So yeah, too late. But anyways, I will be doing three. And first off, I will be applying the gesso. Um, the, the other day, I was talking to to an artist, to a painter, and he said, I'm in, in Spanish, I gotta say that, it was in Spanish, and he said, gesso, and I just, I felt so dumb, because every time, I, I used to call it gesso, you know, but then I realized that in Spanish, we have to say gesso instead of gesso, and yeah, I felt kind of dumb, but then I was just like, all right, sorry, I meant that, like, yeah, so <laughs> but yeah, I'm just applying the the gesso on on the three little pieces of of paper. This is watercolor paper, by the way. Um, I kind of hate this paper because it has like a weird texture. Not like I think. Well, I think it's too much texture. I don't like totally smooth paper, but this one has too much texture. <sighs> so yeah. Um, now I realize that it wasn't necessary to record like the three, three little papers being, being, um, primed, I guess. But yeah, they're ready. And then with my, oh, by the way, the other day I bought the 150 color pencils Prismacolor set and oh my god, I love them. I'm using one of them, of course, and I love this green. Well, Actually, I love every single single color on the set. I think they're really pretty and pretty pigmented. However, on this video, I will not be using them um, for other than the sketch. So yeah, <laughs> and then I, I just like do another sketch but with pencil because I can't see a lot with the colored pencils. And yeah, so the sketch is ready. And now, oh, I was moving the color, the oil paints, to another palette because the other one was too big and I, I couldn't handle it. But yeah. <sighs> now, I made a mistake in here because I applied like very thick layers of paint, and I just didn't thought about that I of me later wanting to put more paint on the paper. It would be too hard and it was it was very hard to put more painting so yeah um don't make that mistake that's why always people say say go thin to thick but i just oh my god i just kind of forgot about everything but yeah i had a very long time without using oils i don't know why but i just well, when I started to paint, it was a medium that I used a lot. And then I kind of got sick of it. <laughs> like, like for real. But, but yeah, now I am trying to go back in it because I think... Well, I know it's a pretty... Really pretty medium. So, yeah. Um, by the way, I regret doing a, a green background. Because I just don't know how to handle green. I think it's a very hard color. I don't know how to explain it, but I hate the way it looks on the background here. Uh, but anyways, little sheep in there. Or those are actually two sheep. Two sheep. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I just remembered. Two sheep. Yeah. This is a pretty nice music. I'm sorry for <laughs> interrupting, but like, I was just listening to it and 
seems like a pretty pretty nice dress you know for the background pretty pretty nice pretty decent i want to say this little painting is not finished i just applied the first layer um so yeah i'm going to with the, the first layer of the second one and i hated the sketch three times i mean i did it two times and the third one was like i gave up so i just go with it <laughs> but i think i did this one really fast mm, i applied the colors more a little more vivid than the other one and a black background just to go sure you know every time i don't know how to paint the, the background i just go with with black and it's always well most of the time it looks really good However, I think I, I went pretty light with the colors of the ship. Um, I think I had to go darker, but I didn't, so I will do that on the second layer. But yeah. Um, however, I love the colors of the of the ship. Yeah, just just they need a little more saturation. But yeah. So at this point, I thought it was going to be a good idea to add like a little, um, well, like those little things, I don't even know how to call them. <laughs> I thought it was going to be a good idea because just a, it would look like the ship is floating, you know? So maybe like a, like a light is, is just, um, you know, just giving them the power to, to float up. But I totally regret it. So I just erased erase them oh my god sorry i can't talk but anyway <laughs> yeah i'm just trying to to go block again and yeah that was a mistake but it got fixed very quickly so yeah i also didn't took a lot of time to do that so it was quick to erase my mistakes i'm noticing that on the camera I, I cannot see a lot of details that I can see um, on her on real life you know there's a lot of colors that I in the camera don't appear you know like they're not visible they don't exist on the camera but they exist on the on real life anyway I started here with the third painting and I love this one I think this one might was my favorite I, I think um, I was watching a, <laughs> a stream, a stream. So yeah, I totally love the colors of the ship. It looks really cool, and I, I also like how, how how big the contrast is with with the background with this red. And I didn't want it to like ruin that contrast, so I tried to put darker red on on the lines of the ship so just so it look like darker yeah just doing that uh but yeah i think this one was my favorite if you are here i mean if you still here uh let me know in the comments like which one you like more or if you hate them all well that's okay it's totally understandable just let me know please please So when I added this black, I mean darker red, <laughs> um, I just had to blend this too, and it was 
really easy and smooth and I love that. It was, I love that. Alright, so this is basically one day later, one day after they dry a little and I'm just checking that in, in the video and I was like, just like, wow, they, they really dried. Uh, but yeah, I'm um, here. Remember when I said that I got it very thick paint at first, just so I, I couldn't add more layers and yeah, well, basically this is what I'm, I was trying to do by, by letting them dry a little. So yeah, I'm, I'm adding extra colors. I mean, the base is already in there, but I'm just adding things to spice up these paintings. And I I really didn't like this one very much. I don't like the background. I really don't know how to draw, I mean, how to paint grass. It's something that I struggle, I always struggle with, with grass. It's just something very, very hard it's so natural that it's very hard but anyways i'm adding just my signature and i i think i'm gonna change my signature because i don't think it fits with my paintings <laughs> uh but anyways yeah this is basically i gave up and i'm just gonna let it that way uh but it's decent i think and then I'm here adding the final details to this to the second one. Uh, this one I, I liked it more. I think it has a little bit more character than the first one. And something that I've noticed is that each one, the latest is the one that I like the most. Like the first one I did, I was like, mm, I, I didn't like it at all. Like not a little bit. And the second one, I was like, oh yeah, this is, this one's a little bit better. And the third one is like, I just love it. It's my little baby. I, I like, I like it. I like it. I tried to go darker, uh, but that was the darker I could. And again, I'm just adding my signature in here. I bought this um, jelly roll white pan and... Well, it works very well. I had one, it wasn't a jelly roll, but it was a white gel pen. And they work very well. I want to buy like black paper, so just so I can do more things. But anyway, that has nothing to do with these little paintings. But yeah, this is my favorite one, as I was saying. I love the color combination. I love the blues and the really vibrant red. And it's a black shape. You know, I love black shapes. Not because I said shapes again. Sorry. No, it's not a potato. I'm talking about sheep. Uh, but yeah. Mm, a sheep is not this color. It doesn't have this background. So I like it. I like it. And my last signature. I had to do it the other way. On the left side. Because the other one was still wet from the paint. So yeah. Um, anyway, I like this one. I think I'm going to, I, I mean, I want to do something pretty with it, you know, but I, I don't know what to do with this because I feel like it's just going to be there on my wall or on my drawer, but I don't know. Hello. So I just finished the paintings. Well, actually a couple hours ago, but I was doing other stuff <laughs> and I wanted to say thank you so much for watching the video. I am, well, not pretty happy with the, with the result of the paintings. Um, however, I think they're decent. I, I don't like this one, the first one. But then with this one and this one, I love them. A little. Maybe I'm gonna use them as a, a gift or I don't know. But like, I'll just let them in there. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching and have a nice day.